Have you figured him out personality wise? <laughs> He's that's a good question, Dan. He he is uh I think he I think he works to make it difficult <laughs> to figure him out. <laughs> uh, he's he is a very very intelligent guy, has a very very broad uh, base of interests. He's he's not a uh, he's not a one trick pony guy, you know. I mean he's he's got a lot going on. He is he is one sharp dude, and I'll tell you, he is a football savant. I can tell you that. This this guy is the Albert Einstein of uh, football, man. He's got. He's got the answers to the test and he ain't cheating. He knows it, man. And it, it's, he's got a confidence as a result of it. He's got an earned confidence that is just, you know, borders on, you know, cocky. He's got the swagger and boy, did his teammates respond to him. I mean, it is unbelievable. He is definitely the duck leading the ducklings. I mean, it's like everybody else is a little line behind the big duck, man. And he's taking the ducklings down to the pond. Fair to make the comparison to Joe Montana. I think it is fair. I think that's a good comparison. I really do. I think that I think they uh, they're very similar. I think Joe might have a little bit stronger arm than Joe Montana, but I think he hit a great one because Joe Montana had that kind of football mind. He had that kind of uh, charisma where his teammates, you know, followed him, followed his lead. And the big thing, uh, and Paul Brown used to say this, and it's, it's so simple, but it's so true. I remember, you know, I was talking to him about quarterback playing. He goes, David, the simple thing about quarterbacks is the most important thing is the simplest thing. I got to throw it straight. You know, I got to be accurate with the football. And man, Joe Burrow can put it in the eye of a needle from 50 yards away. And that's what uh, Joe Montana could do. Kenny Anderson, all the great quarterbacks that, you know, had that accuracy, pinpoint accuracy.